Hello, I just got Lila back at it again with another intro that I forgot to record beforehand. Oh, um, this is a 3D transforming cage cuff tutorial. I posted this in a server a while ago and I got a person asking for a tutorial. So if you're that person, here you go. Love you. To start, you make a basic X base cuff, one X high. Once you're done with that, you want to make a second one and set that second one aside for later. Start off in one of your point beads and build a spike with three perler beads, one pony bead, and three more perler beads. should look like this once you're done repeating it all the way around the cuff. Then you're going to go into one of the points and then build the exact same kind of point on top of that, which is three perler beads, one pony bead, and three perler beads. Should look like this. Here's a slowed down clip of me doing it. I feel like this is a lot easier to see. Once you're done repeating it fully around the cuff, it should look like this. And then you repeat that again, and again, and one more time, and that is four rows of this. To finish it, you go onto one of these points on the very end of your netting, I guess. You add three perler beads, but you don't add a pony bead. You thread it through a pony bead on the second x base cuff that you made. You add three more perler beads and then thread it through the next bead in that cuff. And then once you tighten it, it should look similar to the connection on the other 3D cuff that connects to the netting, if that makes sense. You repeat this all the way around the cuff fully. Here's another slowed down clip of me doing that. should look like that. This is yet another slowed down clip because this part is pretty hard to do actually. Three perler beads. Then you connect to this point on the spike. And then you add another three perler beads and thread it back into your X base cuff. This is how it should look when it's done. And this is a fully finished 3D cage cuff, transforming cage cuff. Also, it is like so crunchy, which is really enjoyable. And there's three different transformations. There is the like super skinny disc-like one with both of the blue flaps out. There's the blue flaps in looking like a regular cage cuff. And then there's the puffy one with both, <laughs> both flaps. Hello, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, yeah, I tried to make it as understandable as possible. If you have any trouble, please let me know and I will gladly help you. My dog is stepping on me right now. Joey says hi to you. He loves you. I love you. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.